Hi guys, Redneck Wannabe here. I hope all is well with you and your family today. So, I'm all proud of myself today because, uh, well, we're, um, I've decided we're going to get pigs. So, I'm going to get three pigs. Uh, we're going to put one in the freezer uh, for us, and then the other two I'm going to try to sell. So, hopefully I'll make some cash there. But, um, but I thought, man, I've got a great idea. I'm going to make a fig, or a fig, a pig feeder and a pig water, and I think I can do it pretty cheap. So, um, so anyway, I've done it, and I've made, mo I've made both for under 50 bucks. But as I'm, as I'm standing here <laughs> looking at them, I'm like, man, I don't know if this is going to last or not. So, uh, anyway, I'm, I'll show you what I did, and, um, you know, so, so we'll see. So, here you go. So, the uh, pig water and the pig feeder and so all I've done is uh, I went to the the feed store I bought two 55 gallon drums for 17 bucks and uh, for the pig water or pig nipples I think those were five bucks so you know uh, the two barrels and the uh, the, the nipples I'm into it forty four dollars and then the two by six we had just laying around the shop, so let's just say that's ten dollars, so 50, 50 to fifty five dollars. I'm into this thing. So um, what I did was just drilled a hole, put the pig nipples in there, tightened them down. They're in there pretty tight. I think I think honestly I think the waterer will do fine. Uh, I just don't know over time if this is going to loosen up and the way the barrel is I can't reach in there <clears throat> and put a bolt around there to around that to secure it anymore but you know first time with pigs I don't know what they're going to do how destructive I hear they're very destructive I just don't know how I think that will last but time will tell on the um, on the feeder I thought, man, what a great idea. I can do this. And then, you know, as I'm putting it together, I'm, I'm looking at it and I'm thinking, man, I just don't know. So you, you can see the holes that I, uh, I cut and then the two by sixes, uh, uh, or two by eight, I guess, whatever it is. So I just cut them. They're, they're not, they're not equally length, uh, long, but just drilled a couple holes, got a, a lag bolt from the bottom, went up, put a washer there. My thinking with the, with the washer is it's going to give it more support, uh, from just ripping a hole in this, uh, in this barrel. So as you can see, it's, it's, it's pretty wobbly. Um, you know, we'll just see what happens. So the thinking is, is I'll just pour the feed directly in, in here. I may end up putting a roof on here and just, you know, uh, just slanting it this way just so the water doesn't drip in. Um, if it does work well, uh, I may drill a hole right here and then uh, with the chicken cone, uh, just may, you know, put a chicken killing cone in there just for a funnel, just to funnel the, um, the food in there. So, you know, 50 bucks or less than... Let's just say less than 55. So a feeder and a water. So we'll see. So I appreciate y'all watching and uh, I appreciate y'all. Y'all take care. Bye.